Ariel, we'll see where it goes. The East Lake Post Office now bears the name of the San Diego officer killed in the line of duty. And 10 News reporter Melissa Masiha was there as Jonathan de Guzman's family shared their memories. What struck me is just how strong and poised his kids are, Jed and Amira. His family lives here in the South Bay, and now his legacy will forever be engraved here. <laughs> Jed de Guzman spoke proudly about his father to a crowd mostly of those who worked alongside him. To me, my father's name will remind me of how amazing he was as my father and how he was always a huge inspiration to me when I came to following my dreams. Jonathan J.D. de Guzman was shot and killed in the line of duty in July. His partner, Wade Irwin, who was at today's ceremony, was seriously hurt and is now recovering. While the pain of that day will never go away, this honors to make sure J.D.'s memory won't go away either. My father's name will remind them of what sacrifices police officers and other first responders make to keep people safe. J.D.'s daughter, Amira, who appeared taller from the last time I spoke with her, smiled as she remembered her dad. Not many people get their father's name on a post office and I felt really happy. I feel very happy that they're still supporting us after still a, almost a year. Support never ending from her dad's brothers and sisters in blue. In Eastlake, Melissa Masiha, 10 News. The effort to rename the post office needed to go through Congress because the post office is on federal land. Congresswoman Susan Davis spearheaded that effort. It became law in December.